Hey everybody, it's Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I'm playing in an art journal this morning and whew, just having a few minutes for myself before I go to work. And I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do about this job. It's, uh, I, I don't want to waste anybody's time by continuing to train if it's not something I want to do for the next 10 years. Ugh, anyway, we won't focus on that. So, I'm just putting layers of paint. And I've got harvest grain, seashell pink, and some vanilla. And where is my... Oh, let me get my cloth, too. I think uh, we see these trends in art journaling. And right now, it's really fun. I'm seeing so many people with, you know, the scribbling and the layers, different colors. It ends up making really beautiful art. And I think it's therapeutic just to see what happens on a page. I'm actually right now just pulling pulling pieces of of music from uh, not music not music only music and words from huh, from the trash can actually and i love that paper will just stick right into acrylic paint i love working with acrylic paint Just a thin layer over that so we can still see the, the music there. And let's put a little bit more of this pink. I think I'll grab. these lids on the shelf to be able to make circles. Let's do some little ones. I'm going to have to buy some paint. It's amazing to me. I think I have so much on hand and then when I actually start looking at it, you know, and trying to figure out what's still good, I realized that I don't have as much as I thought I did. Because it does dry up. It, um, sometimes gets stringy, especially the bottles. And nobody wants to be messing with stringy paint. So let's put a little bit more of the pink up here. Here's some more words. Now it's funny, this one has the tiniest bit of green in that corner. I'm going to cover it up. Might show through a tiny bit. It's funny how layers are like that. And maybe I will take, I don't know if I want to add, I wonder if I add a little bit of the chocolate brown. Seems like it's nice to have at least three different colors. I know we've got the vanilla, but to me that's not, that's pretty in there. And 
little more paint. Get a stiffer brush, maybe. And now, I wonder if I have, what kind of pencil is this? I don't want that metallic. really just want a watercolor pencil. even wet it. Let's just put some circles over there in the darker color and we'll go back over this and kind of hide them here. And maybe I also want to get some paper here that was really heavier. It's almost that harvest green color. I might put one of those in and kind of heavy down here so let's add let's just put that in there. Get this extra paint off my hands. came out there. I really like the thick layers. I don't always have time to dry things because of my work schedule. So sometimes what I do is take paper that seems like it will soak up. Oh, let's see. I'm pulling out one piece and three pieces are coming out. This paper seems to soak up paint and things like that pretty nicely. So I don't mind just going over a page and lifting off some excess like that. And of course that's going to change 
the way this looks a bit, but then come back again. I'm gonna be brave and put it right on the canvas because that's kind of one of the things I wanna do right now. I think I told you about this. I'm gonna be using this canvas or uh, this, yeah, it's kind of like a canvas. It's a big, heavy fabric. And I'm feeling a little bit, mm, how am I feeling right now? I'm feeling a little bit um, overwhelmed, and a lot of that has to do with this job. I've talked to some of you a little bit off the, off the record, maybe. I, I have a hard time keeping up lately. I'm just not sure that this is what I feel like I'm in a in a mill like like grinding gears too much too much everything too much too fast and I feel like a lot of corporate situations are like that so this might end up being the theme of this page and I know that I have to make some sort of decision. Thank you for the encouragement, by the way. Some of you I've spoken to, I hesitate to say too much. I just, I don't want to bad mouth anyone or anything or any place. And then like, this is what I feel like. And then a little bit of this. And if it tears up some paper, that's fine. I'm going to stick that right back down. Here, let me grab one more thing. I'm actually going to stop right here, I think. I, and because even though this is a really thick puddle, that's gonna dry. There, we thinned it out a little bit. I just uh, kind of blew that out a little bit. I do like the way that that wheat color is getting in there, the harvest grain. I wonder if I could somehow... I need a straw out here. Oh, and you know what? I have this, where is it? I have some black that's really watery. I don't know if I poured water in here. I don't really know what happened to that. But I think dropping out a few drops of the black would be good. like a hand or a monster with its arms out and a hood on. This is the way I feel right now. I'm going to leave that. That's my art journal page for today. When it dries, I'll sign it. So, all right, I'm going to stop for now. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel. I really appreciate it. Thank you to new subscribers. I'll be back really soon. Bye for now.